Hey guys, Nishkarsh this side. In this video, we are going to be speaking about how you can find the right suppliers or vendors for e-commerce business. Okay, so a supplier or vendor is the one who ships your products China or somewhere else directly to your customers. Ko. So the question is, how can you find them? The easiest way to find them is on websites like AliExpress or Alibaba. You can also find them on uh, websites like Etsy, E-T-S-Y. You can find them on Etsy, you can also find them on eBay. But mostly all these vendors are going to be available on AliExpress or Alibaba. Now, how do you identify if the vendor is right for you or not? You will have to speak to the vendor. Like when, so we, we sell t-shirts in the last two and a half years of, you know, so Till today, in the last two and a half years, we've sold around 1,75,000 t-shirts. All right. So we have suppliers, we have vendors from China. So when we find a supplier, we would ask them these kind of questions that, what is your t-shirt quality? Could you send me a sample? We definitely need to check a sample of the product that they're going to be giving us. All right. But I did this only after, you know, I was already active in the business. You don't want to get into the loop. You don't, don't get into the loop of asking for samples from everywhere because first you want to sell something, first get some money in your bank account and then you can start asking these questions. All right. So this question is for later. You know, once you've already started selling, then you can invest your time in quality checks and everything. But initially, when you get started with the business, instead of quality and everything else, your focus should be to make money. Your focus should be to make money ethically in the right way. That's it. All right. Now, how do you choose someone? You like the biggest factor is communication. So when you communicate with a vendor, when you communicate with a supplier, you know, you should build a synergy with them. Make synergy. When you talk to them, you should understand that they are making this thing. 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 जैसे अगर आपका वेंडर आपको 24 घंटे के बाद रिप्लाई कर रहा है तो सोचो जब आप उसके साथ काम करोगे तब कितना टाइम लेगा राइट right? अगर वो अभी से ऐसा कर रहा है तो एक्सेप्शन हो सकते हैं बट आपको ऐसी चीजें जज करनी है कि वो आपको कितना अच्छे से रिप्लाई कर रहा है वो आपको कैसे कैसा ट्रीट कर रहा है क्योंकि मेन आपका ना वेंडर रिलेशनशिप ये रहेगा यहाँ पे बहुत ज्यादा काम आता है प्रोडक्ट्स आर द सेम सो एवरी वेंडर इन चाइना देर आर मिलियन ऑफ वेंडर्स इन चाइना एंड दे हैव एक्सेस टू मिलियन ऑफ प्रोडक्ट सो इफ यू हैव अ वेंडर एंड इफ आई हैव अ वेंडर Both our vendors are going to have access to the same set of products, to the same quality. Everything is going to be the same. But what's going to matter is going to be the relationship that you are going to have with yours and I'm going to have with my vendor. That's the most important thing because when you get started with a dropshipping or e-commerce business, uh, your relationship with the vendor is going to matter a lot. If something goes wrong, your vendor should be there to help you. Like our vendor uh, sends free reshipments as any, if, if, if something is wrong with a t-shirt quality that a customer receives, our vendor has promised us and they've been doing this as well. They send uh, a reshipment for free. We don't have to pay anything for it. If something is, uh, goes wrong, like the size, the quality or anything else. All right. They also send these welcome notes and welcome cards along every package that we send that have our brand logo and a thank you message and a coupon code. They, they do that for free for us. All right. So it's all about building relationships. So I would say when you're going on AliExpress or Alibaba, uh, either you already know the product that you want to sell. So just search for that product. Uh, you're going to see listings and uh, then click on the name of the vendor and you can talk to them via AliExpress, then get them on Skype, ask them for their Skype ID because these people are very active on Skype and then you can start chatting with them. All right. Uh, or if you want to if you want to find something for print on demand or t-shirts custom t-shirts just search for print on demand custom t-shirts shirts uh, any of these on aliexpress or alibaba contact the vendor have a conversation with them and see you know negotiate with them see how well they're treating you see how 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 responsive they are ask them for a pitch ask them for a few pictures of the products that they have ask them for the product quality now listen ho sakta hai that you don't even know ki product quality achhi kaun si buri kaun si hai when we started i hardly knew anything about t-shirts maine bola quality kya hai usne bola screen printing i went to google and i saw and i was okay to maine you know when i when i went to google maine google pe dekha ki screen print, printing ke bhi types hote hain to maine bola acha kaun si type ki hai <laughs> so you know then you just you want to be smart you ask them questions they give you something you go and research about it in google you come back and you ask more questions based on that your vendor your supplier is going to know that you're not just a newbie you really know what you're talking about and you don't want to show them that you know you're just starting out and you don't know anything about it you you want to you know go there uh, you know ek tor ke sath jao ek, ek strength ke sath jao ki listen uh, uh, you know I'm, I'm i'm into this business i'm already into e-commerce uh, i'm already into e-commerce i'm starting to sell uh, t-shirts and i'm expecting some good revenues in the upcoming months uh, what quality uh, of printing do you have that's the attitude that you should be having instead of going ki main india se ho main jaldi start karo mere paas zyada paise nahi hai please mera rate kam kar do don't do that okay don't do that have the right mindset when you're going to be approaching your business and if you feel you don't have the right mindset i will highly highly recommend you to have a look at the have a look at all the other videos that we have on this channel all right so that's it guys this is nishkar i'm going to see you in the next video bye yeah.